think Orange Theory is on class pass. What inspired you to do 12,000 steps a day? Um, honestly, to just like get up and move and not be so fixated on my phone or on my computer. Bracelets are from Amazon. They're on my storefront, same with this one. Do you think I'll stay long-term in Florida? Um, no, probably like two more years. Thank you. I would not move to Los Angeles, no. It's a little too, uh, I don't know. I would move to San Diego. Fave stores to shop at. Um, probably Aritzia, Aloe Yoga. Um, I find a lot of good stuff on Amazon. Um, uh, Airy, I've been loving Airy recently. I did a huge haul today, huge haul. Um, everything I bought is on my shop line. I'm also gonna post Instagram stories, but oh my God, I bought the cutest shit ever. Literally the cutest stuff, you guys. Sweet treat, oh, I have a fridge full of sweet treats right now. My favorite one is um, the Sweet Lorenz cookies. But I found out yesterday that they have palm oil in them and palm oil is terrible for you. So won't be having those anymore, which is a bummer. Aloe or Lulu, aloe. Favorite conditioner Rex for blondes, honestly, I feel like I don't, oh, what is it? I think it's by the brand Eva NYC, E-V-A NYC. It's their purple bottle. And I think it's called like Blonded Up or something. No, the aloe gym is on my bucket list. My life bucket list. What would I like to do before the year ends? I would like to go on a solo trip. I'm not a model, no. No, sir. I have tried CrossFit, yeah. I like it. Post has a new album? I did not know this. Oh, I do not get paid a lot on TikTok, no. Ooh, I'll have to give it a listen. Tell me why you seem like you only date guys with blonde hair and blue eyes, because that's been my past, okay? And history repeats itself, but it's not gonna repeat itself anymore, okay, okay. The last guy I dated though, he had brown hair. Brown hair and blue eyes. But. Mm 
I love how like literally 30 minutes ago I was gonna make dinner and now everything is sitting right there. Plans for tonight, you guys, lounging. My friends are going out, but I just, I'm gonna be honest, I don't really like to go out, so. I'm here. <laughs> I am here and chilling, which is totally okay. I usually go to bed at like midnight lately, which is not a good habit to be in. I don't have any good book recs right now. Um, Love in Other Words, actually, that's a really good book. I loved that book. Um, the House Made. And then I read the second one of that book, too. Those are really good. I love, what's her name? Brick, what's that author? It's at the tip of my tongue. Um, it's like Mick something. You guys, what is the author's name? It's gonna bug me. Um, what's her name? McFadden, Frida McFadden. Thank you, thank you. That was literally gonna bug the heck out of me. I knew it started with an M. But yeah, I love Frida McFadden books. But no, I need to find some good ones for the fall. I want some good like fall cozy reads. I usually wake up at 6.30. The inmate, yes. I just get cold brew with a splash of almond milk. What kind of almond milk? Almond milk? One favorite makeup item at the moment. Oh my gosh, I was literally just thinking about this. The, um, let me show you guys actually. Wait, no, it's the, what's it called? Sephora lip liner. So good. I don't know. I don't really have a f preference of almond milk. One skincare favorite at the moment. Soy face cleanser, but I don't have it. I ran out of it. So option number two. Hmm. It's a good question. I love there's a lot of skincare things that I love. Um oh, the Sunday Riley CEO Glow Serum. So good. So good.